Moving into March means moving out those ice houses in Minnesota this weekend. With warmer weather and the danger of thin ice, some families are taking precautions. Nearly 200 people braved the wind at the Youth Ice Fishing Derby held by the Fargo Park District at Woodhaven Pond. Valley News Team's Christina Craig found some parents aren't taking any chances for thin ice. Oh, there's a whopper there. Look at that one. Wow! With nearly 80 families out on Woodhaven Pond, a total of 29 fish were hooked. The biggest, a 27 inch northern pike. Crashing around and then heard my pole go and caught it. <laughs> This isn't Jacob Hardy's first time ice fishing. It's a sport he shares with his dad every winter. It's just a nice day. It's a reason to go outside with the kids and enjoy the weather. With 24 inches of ice, many families weren't concerned with falling through, but it didn't stop the Hardys from taking security measures of their own. Try to be safe and don't take any, under, any unnecessary risks. If I don't think it's safe, we walk out. We don't drive out. We just usually have a rope and stuff with life jackets and a sled. Jacob says the clearer the ice, the sturdier it is. Yep, rock solid ice. Really crystal clear ice is what you want, and that's what we have. You know, in the next few weeks when it starts to warm up, that's when people really got to start to be concerned. And anytime you're on moving water, that's when your ice safety is really crucial to be paying attention to where you're going. By keeping safety in mind. I'm more worried about it being cold than you are about falling through the ice. That's not about catching fish in my opinion. It's more about hanging out with my family and having a good time. In Fargo, Christina Craig, Valley News Live. The Fargo Park District says this was their eighth youth ice fishing derby and they look forward to planning this event again next winter.